still confused between addition silicons and condensation silicons? Let's fix that in under 90 seconds. Addition silicons set by an addition polymerization reaction producing no byproducts. So shrinkage is minimal. However, during setting, they may release hydrogen gas which can create voids in the port cast. To overcome this, manufacturers add hydrogen scavengers such as palladium. Condensation silicons on the other hand set by a condensation reaction releasing ethyl alcohol which evaporates and causes volumetric shrinkage. Addition silicons have excellent dimensional stability and a long shelf life. So pouring can be delayed and casts can be poured multiple times if the impression is stored well. Condensation silicons are less stable and must be poured immediately and they allow for only a single pour. They have a shorter shelf life because of their sensitivity to humidity. Addition silicons are modified with surfactants making them more hydrophilic so that they flow better even in moist areas. Condensation silicons are inherently hydrophobic so oral fluids can cause voids or bubbles making them highly technique sensitive. Addition silicons have higher elastic recovery so they resist distortion even when removed from undercuts. Condensation silicons may tear or distort if removed prematurely or with deep undercut engagement. Addition silicons reproduce fine detail with excellent accuracy. They can capture finish lines and gingival margins clearly. Condensation silicons capture acceptable detail if used properly and poured quickly but are prone to voids and drags. Clinically, addition silicons are the material of choice for crowns, bridges, implant impressions and occlusal registration. Condensation silicons are used for less critical impressions such as primary impressions, provisionals and less demanding full denture impressions, especially in cost sensitive situations. So that's the quick comparison between addition and condensation silicons. Hope that helps. Click the link below and subscribe to Dentistified if you are serious about prostho.